He was an American psychologist, born in 1929, like Jeff He's famous for his analysis of being sane and insane play. This it tested the validity of psychiatric diagnosis. OMG is such a cool word, cystic fibrosis. Yeshiva, yeah, Columbia, dang. The man got it all for bang. One day in the 1970s, David Rosenhan, yeah, he really started to wonder. Psychologists could tell the same from the insane or if they blunder. Hired eight people to fake into mental hospitals. New docs focus on diagnosing and prescribing pills. Old Rosenhan told them to act insane. Say, I hear a voice and it says thud, 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 thud. Inside their heads, hallucinations, yo, they would act normal once they got in the They all got in, then said the voice was gone, they weren't believed, weren't allowed to leave They took the fat pills but had tricks off their sleep Freaky freaky what, what, freaky freaky what, what, paranoid schizophrenia all rose in head Was told he had it but he was normal and he took notes on the stuff They saw it as insane, tough, patients knew he was a bluff The shortest of the stays was seven days, seven days the longest of the stays was 52 days. Had to admit to having a psychiatric condition. We're discharged with schizophrenia in remission. Thud, 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 thud. Nobody has detected their sanity. They were angered and they swear to get back at Rosie. Then they dare him to send more fakes to their hospital. Three months they said they would find his fakes. Well, they found 42, but he said nobody at all. There were two psych manuals for disorders one DSM and DSM 2, moreover. Rosie said they were puzzling that they made psych confusing. Second hit rock bottom, people are losing faith in it. He got him. People so appalled about fooling. Psychologist was as easy drooling. Then Robert Spitzer, a psych professor dude, came into this depressing picture he glued. Psych's fallen pieces back together. He edited it and rewrote the manual. Weather was looking good because it deleted the confusion. It was called DSM-3 in 1980 conclusion. We're about there, but I got a few more words to say. Even 30 years after it all, they still give a study credit and all. He showed people a psych diagnosis depends on the situation that the observer finds a patient in connotation. He discredited psych diagnosis or Rosen Hammy. He liked my homies, Wheezy and Tiny Yeah, Spitz and him got the swaggy.